হুজুর ইন দাহলি কোরআন সেজ দ্যাট ইফ এনিবডি ফলোড ইন দ্য প্রিভিয়াস রিলিজিয়ন এনি এনি অফ দ্য প্রফেটস অর দ্য বিগেস্ট অফ দ্য প্রফেটস অফ দোজ রিলিজিয়ন দেন দ্য ম্যাক্সিমাম স্পিরিচুয়াল স্ট্যাটাস এনিবডি অ্যাচিভড ওয়াজ স্ট্যাটাস অফ এ সিদ্দিক সিদ্দিকিয়ত নোবডি রিচড টু দ্য লেভেল অফ নবু বাই ফলোইং এনি প্রিভিয়াস প্রফেট who says that um who shan't zimo no 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 this is the he says this is uh, a verse of the holy quran uh according which, to which verse uh, i this is uh, verse number 20 of surah al hadith i agree with that but first read the verse then i'll explain okay surah hadith 20 أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والذين آمنوا بالله ورسله أولئك هم الصديقون والشهداء عند ربهم لهم أجرهم ونورهم والذين كفروا وكذبوا بآياتنا أولئك أصحاب الجهيم This is the uh, But how can you infer what he has inferred from this verse? Um, he says I don't know This is not the right verse for your purpose. It deals with a different subject altogether. The verse you should have mentioned is in Surah An-Nisa. Verse أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم ومن يطع الله والرسول فاولئك مع الذين انعم الله عليهم من النبيين والصديقين والشهداء والصالحين وحسن اولئك رفيقا This is verse number 70 of Surah An-Nisa which is chapter number 4 Translate The translation is and whoso obeys Allah and his messenger of his Yeah. Our Rasul means yes. this particular messenger. And this messenger of his mm. shall be among those on whom Allah has bestowed his blessings, namely the prophets, the truthful, the martyrs, and the righteous. And excellent companions are these. So by the blessing of following the Holy Prophet, no... members of the munam alah grow are exempted at all all on whom allah bestowed his blessings right beginning from the beginning of salihin then shuhada then siddiqin then anbiya the prophets of god and they are all mentioned and the second men is min bayaniya Ma can be translated as the Maulvis prefer to have it translated. They would not be among Siddiq, they would not be among Salihin, they would not be among the martyrs, they would not be among the prophets of Allah. But they would be with them. This is an insult to the Holy Prophet. It's impossible that all who follow him honestly and do whatever he commands them to do would not be raised even to the first step of salihin though they would all be with him with him with him so the word min indicates ulaika malazin anna malu alahim minan nabiyina ma means a that is to say they would be among the prophets was siddiqin and among the righteous that is you know the word term siddiq the highest office after a prophet is siddiq after the office of prophet the highest is that of siddiqin then shuhada and then salihin so a translation 
is uh, a tribute to the greatness of Ahmad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. the Mullah's translation is an insult to him and his office. Insult to him and his office. Now, this is also an answer to your question about Khatwa Nabi. Zur, after I translate this bit, then I, I want to clarify. Uh, I want to give a clarification. I think I couldn't explain properly his question. So first, answer this, Jay. and then we'll see. If he agrees, Jay. then you don't have to put any clarification. Okay. Zur, what is the meaning of the word? In English, also you say, uh, they, you can say, they would be with them, that is to say, they would be among them. So this style of the Quran is exactly like this. Uh, 